Hi there, let's take a look at more factors causing uneven development. Economic factors. So, lots of debt. Poor countries often have to get loans from wealthier countries. Borrowed money has to be repaid, often with interest. And the country in debt can't spend its revenue on developing because it has to repay its debts first. An economy dominated by primary production. Primary products of raw materials, such as wood, metal and stone. Countries that mainly export raw materials are usually less developed because these products are not very profitable. Additionally, the price of primary products often fluctuate. This means they go up and down. This means that the price is sometimes less than the production cost. Also, the poor trade links. Traders are buying and selling of goods and services. Economies are heavily affected by wild trade patterns. Poor trade links will limit a country's revenue and therefore the amount of money available to invest in them. Let's just quickly recap that. What are the main economic reasons for uneven development? These are poor trade links, lots of debt, and an economy denominated by primary production. Now let's have a look at the consequences of uneven development. This is health. More developed countries have better healthcare systems, which means life expectancy is greater and infant mortality rates are lower. For example, Chad has 85 deaths per 1,000 births compared to four in the UK. There's also international migration. People try to enter a neighbouring country if it's more developed because of the promise of a better quality of life. For example, more than 130,000 Mexicans migrate legally to the US every year. Wealth. People have greater income in more developed countries. For example, the GNI per head in Chad is 40 times lower than in the UK. Let's quickly do a recap of that. What are the examples of the consequences of uneven development? There are over 130,000 Mexicans legally migrate to the USA every year. There are 85 deaths per 1,000 babies born in Chad compared to four in the UK. And GNI per head in the UK is 40 times higher than in Chad. What does an uneven development lead to large differences in? Is it wealth, wealth, and international migration? Trade is the buying and selling of goods and services. Poor trade links will limit the country's revenue, therefore the amount of money available to invest in development. What are the consequences of un uneven development? There are large differences in wealth, large differences in healthcare, and large differences in international migration. Uneven development leads to large differences in wealth, health, and international migration.